escape our grasp. Thank you, Major Know-It-All! Now, will you stop that sheep? I wouldn't have to if you hadn't let the sheep get away. Oh, never mind. I'll get him myself. You'd think someone would be cueing chase music about now. That's where you're going. But I don't... Ah. That's okay. It's just that we're paying. It's cheap. Smart move. Sheep's dashing into the super exclusive disco Studio 56. It's too old better than Studio 54, you know. <laughs> Out of the way! Are you cool? I can't let you in unless you're cool. Okay, I'm cool. I'm cool. Now, out of the way! Sorry, Daddy-O. Now what? Cool people never say that they are cool. It's uncool. Fine! I'm not cool! I'm a loser! Now please get out of my way! Only cool people allowed! And you just said that you're not cool! I hate these Catch-24s! For the last time, my sizable military detachment and I are getting into this disco and no flimsy little velvet rope is going to stop us! Hi, wanna dance? <laughs> oh, come on. Yeah. Come on, what? Will wonders never cease? No, wonders will never cease. Take your booty, sheep. <laughs> Stupid bouncer. Thinks he's so big. Yes, sir. Remember when he said to me, he said, You can't come in. You're not cool. I should have said to him, uh, Oh, yeah? Or maybe, Says who? Everyone thinks of the perfect comebacks when it's too late, sir. Not me. I always know what to say. You're a real pain, Major Know-It-All. I know that. Ugh. At least Sheep will be out of that disco soon. He hates parties. Well, how about that? It's nice for a change to end a chapter with sheep safe and happy. Ah. Ah. Uh, what? Who's grabbed sheep? I guess we'll find out in the spine-riveting chapter two, Party of the Sheep! And now for another moment with Buddy. Today's moment, friendship. Hello, my name is Buddy. Friendship. What is friendship? Well, my dictionary defines friendship as the joining of two complementary turbines in a steam-powered combustible engine. I have a very bad dictionary, and for that, I apologize. This has been another Moment with Buddy. When we last left Sheep, a mysterious pair of hands grabbed him. Whose mysterious hands are they? Let's find out. Chapter 2, Party of the Shear. Wow, those hands.
things belong to General Lee? Outrageous! General Specific's nemesis, who appeared briefly in episode 11. Sheep baby, you sure can party! I just loved your moves. Ooh, ah, oh yeah! Ow! You are the man! Sheep. You are the sheep! <laughs> I'm serious, dude. Why don't you come on down to my place with the gang and party till you drop? It's always a good time! Right, Private Party? It's groovy tooby. It's also pretty cool. <laughs> so what do you say, sheep? You coming? Huh? Huh? Are you? Are you coming? Let's boogie on down! Looks like sheep's having a blast! Blast! I can't understand how that sheep got away again! Sheep escaped into a disco, but you couldn't capture him because the bouncer didn't think you were cool enough. I wish you'd stop summarizing my predicaments, private public! That's what we have the plot device for! Hello. Now, help me figure out a way to be cool so I can capture that sheep! You could sit in a refrigerator. Refrigerators are cool. Uh, thanks, major embarrassment. We could say man a lot. Cool people say man all the time. Man. Not bad, Corporal Ethereal. Weird, but not bad. Keep thinking. Well, I got nothing. We could follow General Lee Outrageous's group that just passed by with sheep. I don't see how that will help me become cool, plot device. I think she was suggesting a course of action, not advice, sir. Siding with her, eh? Well, if you love the plot device so much, why don't you marry her? And so, General Specific and his troops go to General Lee Outrageous's base. Hey! I thought I was the general around here. Will you just go? Okay, okay. Jeez, everyone is so pushy today. Good thing.